Hey guys, it's Allie. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I spring clean my bathroom plus some organizational tips for your bathroom. So let's get started. First, we gotta disinfect this bathroom. So after I clean the mirrors, I will be moving everything from one side of the counter to the other side and then clean that area and do the same thing for the other side. And for this part, I'll be using Lysol and it's my fave because it doesn't have a harsh cleaning smell. Now that everything is disinfected, we can get started with organizing everything on the counter. And there's no wrong or right way to do this, I'm just going to be putting everything in its place. I actually made this DIY tray on Seventeen Magazine's channel, so if you want to go check that out, I will have the link in the description. And I'm using this tray to place my daily body lotion and body mist on. I replaced this decorative candle for some flowers to add a spring kind of feeling to the bathroom. Moving on to underneath my sink, this area definitely needs a lot of decluttering. I'm taking these dividers that I got at TJ Maxx for under $10 and using them to store my unused makeup. And I'm taking another one and putting it right on top and using it to store more makeup, of course, but you can use these for anything you need to put in it. I have these purple holder things and I'm using them to store my unused makeup brushes and mascaras. I found these cool almost shower organization things but these have hooks and are especially made for doors and not for your shower. I put stuff like hair products, body mist, hair clips, all types of stuff and honestly it's been a complete lifesaver. You guys know I love to use baskets to organize just about anything, so I'm using a small basket to put my hairbrushes in. Finally, I added some flowers, and honestly, I just did this because it makes me happy when I open this up and I see them. To organize my extra toilet paper rolls, I used, of course, a basket and placed it on top of my toilet. I also used these tiny little towels, rolled them up, and put them in the basket. Now it's time for me to put all my dirty clothes into my laundry basket. Now I'm vacuuming my floor before I put my clean rug on it, obviously. And lastly, I'm just adding some finishing touches. I found this super chic candle holder and I'm putting a mini candle inside, which is probably the cutest little candle I've ever seen. I hope you guys all found this video helpful and if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys all in my next video. Love you guys. Bye!